the fact that <laughs> Jews wanted to leave. In fact, by 1940, half the Jews of Germany have left. Why? Because they saw. The problem was that there was no place to go. In 1938 of September, imagine, 1938 September, there's a conference in a place called Avion. There are 36 nations sitting there looking at the problem of immigration, of refugees. Already in 1938, you're talking about people wanting to leave. Only one country is willing to take up to 70,000 Jews, the Dominican Republic. Here is the world looking at the problem and saying no. And precisely because of that, Adolf Hitler takes the hint. Nobody wants the Jews. In fact, in one of his speeches, he's very clear. He says, look, here is this wonderful country called America whose population density is one-tenth of ours. They don't want any Jews. Jews wanted to leave. And from a personal perspective, my family in 1939 from Slovakia wanted to leave. And in fact, we applied to the American embassy, got the appropriate papers, and we got a number. Like in a bakery. The difference is in a bakery, it's a half hour, bedtime, 45 minutes. The line that was formed was six years long. So not only is the problem of not seeing, the problem is where to go.